Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, my name's JP and this is Terra Online. This is going to be a series that I'm going to be doing personally on this channel and it's also going to be coming from other directors as well. Basically we are going to be doing, this first little section here is going to be picking your character. Now it is very important on what character you do end up picking and I'm going to go through them right now. So obviously the first character that you potentially could pick would be the human race and the human race obviously is one of those races that uh, pretty much have in every MMO RPG that you can possibly think of if you don't know what this game is this game is a free to play action MMO and uh, it is extremely exciting as of February 1st it will go free to play look forward to more content coming from red light broadcasting but moving on to the castanics now this is more of those uh kind of uh, morphed humans and high elves basically combined they look pretty cool i like the, the, the design that they have on them more than likely i will end up picking one of those now these ones here are a very awesome class i love the way that they look they're very brute looking class they're called the Aman, or the Amen, or however you want to pronounce it. Put the emphasis on wherever. But uh, this is a definitely an interesting race, if you will. Um, this is the Papori. Now, the Papori, um, I don't go through it on this video, but if you guys would like to see a more in-depth look at the Papori, I can definitely do so. Um, basically, you can do uh, a bunch of different animals, and we'll go on from there. Anyways, this is the Ellen class. I'm not a big fan of the Ellen class. Let me know in the comments section below what you guys think. But uh, me personally, not a big fan. Um, now the Baraka is uh, gender lock. You can only be male on that one. I should actually uh, say that for the Ellen as well. The Ellen, you can only be female. So there you go. And the Papori is not really gender locked. It's more race, like uh, animal locked. Now the High Elf, this guy always uh, reminded me of like a young... Elvis kind of a deal and then there's the other one as well so you've definitely got the Castanix like I said it's basically a combination of the uh, high elves and the humans makes the Castanix but uh, yeah that's that's pretty much about it guys we're gonna go ahead in our next episode and we're going to actually pick one of these amazing amazing little things here but uh, first of all, I want to show you what we did, what there is. There's obviously a warrior. There's going to be a lancer, as you see there. Um, Lancer's obviously got the shield and the lance. That's hence why the name lancer. Slayer is going to be the next one. Slayer is basically, um, you've got a two-handed melee weapon. That's also going to be used for burst DPS melee leather armor. The skill players, you notice there, uh, just beside where it says berserker, player skill required the more stars the more difficult it is because remember this is a action MMO so you really have to point and click where you want to shoot or whatever it may be in the case of the sorcerer then you would have to point and click and dodge and all that other kind of stuff now the archer itself is obviously a fairly easy class you can literally point shoot and away you go you do not have to worry about you know recuperating your ammo or anything like that because it's unlimited Priests, obviously, is going to be your healing class. Uh, it's a clothy, obviously, ranged healer, the whole nine yards. And then we have, obviously, the Mystique. Now, the Mystique is going to be one of the most difficult classes to actually play in the game. It is a support healer, but it is also a ranged attack player as well. So there you go, guys. If you like this, stay tuned to next episode, where next episode we are going to be covering creating your class. We just picked our, our race and we saw some classes there. So stay tuned to next episode. And until next time, we'll talk to you guys later. Peace.